Hello guys, welcome to another video of Adama Robotics. In this video we're going to show you how to connect the bell with a Bluetooth controller app. Okay, so first of all we have to go to our phone and turn the Bluetooth controller app. So once you turn the app you will see a UI like this where the bell has only two control modes where the bell is like this and the draw line mode. First of all we're going to go here but before we go there we have to connect the bell. Okay, so if you want to connect a bell, what you have to do is you have to turn the bell on first, otherwise the Bluetooth is not going to be on, okay? Now, once the bell is on, you can see it's detected on our app, so just select it and it should be connected shortly. Now, um, our bell is ready to do the work. So let's go to the bell mode. Here you can see on the left side, this is a joystick. You can go to the front and control the bell very easily, okay? For example, here, I will show you the left side, you go front, you go front. You go at the back. You see, you have to keep it for a couple of sec uh, mini seconds, okay? Because it's um, um, you know Bluetooth control device, so it takes a little bit of time. You see? So if I could go to the right, it goes to the right. If I go to the front, it goes to the front. If I go to the back. It goes to the back okay now we have a couple of things here ultrasonic sensor this measures the distance from the um, sensor from like how far the object is then we have the on the right corner you can see the lights right so here what it does is basically it lights up the LEDs on the top okay just beside the eyes and then you can see it changes color okay you can even turn it off by pressing this play button now, um, I'll show you the random light um, button here. You see the random light is going to change uh, over and over. And we have um, another thing that is the buzzer. It's going to horn, okay? And then we have the G sensor. So what G sensor does is basically it moves with your phone. So now the phone is tilted. If you tilt it to the front, you see that it goes to the front. You go to the back, to the left, to the right. This is amazing, isn't it? Now what we're going to do is we're going to turn it off, otherwise uh, it's going to you know, keep our robot moving. So now let's go back to another mode that we have that is the draw line mode. So once you go to the draw line mode, what you need to do is you need to draw a line. Don't make it too zigzag because the robot cannot read it many times, okay? So this is an experimental app, so let's see what happens with our robot, okay? So it goes to the front and it goes to the right. Okay, so since I'm shooting it on a green uh, cloth, okay, that's why the territory wasn't proper. Now let's just clear it again and um, let's do a straight right cut, okay? Let's see what happens now. It goes to the front and then it turns to the right. You see? <laughs> Due to my surface, that's why it's doing something like that. Or we can clear the screen and now it will turn before. So this is how you can control the bell through the bell app. Thank you so much for watching guys. Hope you're going to have a great day.